Hi there, and welcome to Apple World. So it seems as though this spilled sound that has been going around the web has at long last affirmed all of our most memorable apprehensions about what, truth be told, happened to Aaliyah, and it is terrible. You all sources are expressing that there's new proof that demonstrates that Did and Jay-Z used to turn AI into freaks. That is not indeed. Even the portion of it purportedly they utilized to pass her around to their companions, and at the point when she attempted to leave, they just coerced her into going on. Yet here's where it gets significantly more obscure. Obviously, not long after she died, Aliyah was at that point wanting to uncover all that she had some awareness of Diddy and Jay-Z and even A.R. Kelly, yet the data she would have spilled was so harmful that they realized they needed to stop her using any and all means, regardless of whether it involved a mishap that absolutely could have been stayed away from. The new subtleties coming out about this story are past surprising you, all yet was Alaya truly taken out since these men needed to quiet her down, what did she truly have some familiarity with Diddy's freak-offs? That was awful to such an extent that it would be able to have cost her life, we should. Separate it, so at this point the greater part of you all probably seen that image that has been becoming a web sensation web-based, showing Leia Diddy D scramble and glow at what seems, by all accounts, too. Oh, be one of Diddy's supposed white gatherings, the photograph catches around six individuals resting on a bed all messed up, and Aaliyah is right in the center of them. They're everything wearing white as well, despite the fact that you would be able to see Diddy and Jlo have different variety of shirts. On the photograph had the web humming since knowing all that we have some familiarity with Mr. Diddy and Jlo's relationship at the time, Diddy himself furthermore, all that Aaliyah went through its trouble. Some not to see the warnings in this present circumstance. I mean, Aliyah's hand-only position is sufficient to make individuals pose inquiries about what was truly happening at this party. Obviously, when the web dives into stories like this, it doesn't give up until there are answers so obviously. Individuals began diving into Aliyah's past and her associations with men encompassing her at that point, and you all the things that they have concocted are simply frigid. There are reports that Aliyah was being cruised around by various men in the business, and that it reached a place where she was tired with all that and needed to lead. And that is where everything took a left go, purportedly the statement, unquote, industry men who were exploiting Aliyah couldn't let her uncover their insider. Facts. So they took her out and made it seem to be a mishap, purportedly. That is the reason till tomorrow, there are still so many unanswered inquiries concerning Aliyah's demise. For what reason did she know? Ed, to be on that plane, for what reason wasn't her family with her? Why was the pilot not cross-checked before he was permitted to fly the plane yet previously? We get into that. How about we all separate Ola's relationship with a portion of these men, so from the viral image of Diddy's all-white party we realize, Diddy needed to have been a major part of Aliyah's life, some way or another, either as a companion or simply an industry partner, however we likewise realize Diddy ran into similar circles with Jay-Z and R. Kelly, and the two of them are known to have had a close connection with Aliyah. Sooner or later brain you these men were no less than 10 years more seasoned than Aliyah, when they were circumnavigating near her, like vultures take R. Kelly for model Aliyah and R. Kelly first met. In 1991, when A. Aliyah was just 12 years old, she was at that point a very gifted artist at that age, and really kind of encouraged her, and turned into her coach however. As he would learn later, he was simply at, tempting to draw near to her so he could g-word her quick forward to 1994, and Aliyah had proactively delivered her collection age and only a number by the way this collection was composed, and delivered by R. Kelly, and on the off chance that you didn't realize the collection is. Fundamentally, about how love will be love, regardless of the age of the individuals included indeed, Aureli was truly telling on himself, however, for some reason it didn't raise warnings for anyone or perhaps it did and ever. I bet he just disregarded it since they were attempting to get that speedy money from Aliyah's prosperity. Anything that it was Aliyah followed through on the cost since witnesses would later affirm that A.R. Kelly begun exploiting her from at the point when she was just 13 in August 1. 1994, just 90 days after the arrival of her presentation collection, Aureli got fashion reports dishonestly announcing Aliyah's age is 18 also. Wedded her utilizing these fashion records when she was just 15 a green. To insiders, Aliyah was as a matter of fact pregnant at that point, and Aureli chose to wed her in secret when he found out about the pregnancy goodness, and he was moreover pushing 30 at the time crushing himself into a marriage with a young lady who was close to around 50% of his age.
It's hazy what at last happened to the pregnancy, or on the off chance that Alaya was ever truly pregnant to start with, however the marriage was annulled in 1995, after Alaya's folks found out sort of makes you can't. Help thinking about how they even permitted the union with a cur in the ahead of everyone else on the grounds that permitting your teen little girl to be separated from everyone else, with the man such a lot of that he could do the things he did to her, is recently off the wall. However, as for Jay-Z, he wasn't very different from his companion, Aureli Jay-Z knew, and saw a portion of the things Aureli did to Aliyah also. What did he do? He didn't do anything as expected the same way he went to every one of those Diddy freak-off gatherings and saw every one of the things going on but did nothing. Supposedly, of course, there were even reports that Jay-Z was attempting to get Aliyah soon after she escaped her harmful relationship with R. Kelly, as indicated by sources. Jay-Z initially had a keen interest in Aliyah, not beyond the main explanation that he was unable to get with her, was that she didn't need him, rather she and Jay-Z's previous closest companion lady run, had a thing continuing, however get this a few sources have uncovered that Jay-Z was super. Distraught about Alaya's dismissal, clearly it might have been important for the motivation behind why Jay-Z had some enmity against Alaya, which is the reason there have forever been hypotheses that Jay-Z had something to do with Alaya's demise for quite a while. Presently, there have been murmurs flying around that Alaya's passing was organized by a specific group to make it seem to be a mishap, however it as a matter of fact, wasn't the reports got considerably more extraordinary as the charges. Encompassing Diddy and Jay-Z being associated with some obscure dealings with more youthful ladies became a web sensation in any case. As you all know, Jay-Z and Diddy have been best friends for a significant can't length of time if there will be a party at the Carter family you can wager Diddy will be there in his Sunday best assuming they're showing up for be a party at Diddy's free off house Jay-Z will be there. He may indeed even appear with the misses each at this point and afterward, and that is the Reason it struck a ton of individuals as odd that Jay-Z chose to drop his Stone Country informal breakfast this year, gracious he attempted to be smooth about it as well, like we wouldn't put two into it. Oh, together he guaranteed it was on the grounds that he what's more, Beyonce had different commitment that they just couldn't miss however assuming that was actually the case, he could have simply moved the date of the informal breakfast or something, since we know how significant that occasion is too. Jay-Z, so wouldn't miss it for something as effectively fixable as an occupied plan. No fans trust the genuine justification for why Jay-Z rejected the entirety thing this year was that he proved unable rep. Isk being bugs celebrating with Diddy furthermore, setting up a party without welcoming his dearest companion would be simply odd, the party ain't going to bang with the at any rate. Diddler sauce obviously well with every one of the bits of hearsay moving around them, individuals have been talking and taking a more intensive gander at every one of the obscure dealings Diddy and Jay-Z had together and surmise what they share for all intents and purpose pursuing more youthful young ladies, supposedly. I mean, just consider it pretty much every lady Jay-Z has at any point been sincerely connected with has been either the age or a newly printed grown-up from Saucy Brown to Rihanna to even Beyonce who was like 17 when Jay's began dating her. Indeed, there's a great deal to influence here, Jay-Z and Diddy have been additionally supposed to go to outrageous lengths to maintain their mysteries under W.S. With regards to Aaliyah, it's accepted that she discovered considerably more about Jay-Z and Diddy's oddity off parties than she ought to have, and she lost her life as a result of spot, consider it you all, so numerous things about Aaliyah's demise don't make any sense as per the authority report. Aaliyah passed on in an unplanned plane accident in course to Florida, later recording a music video in the Bahamas, yet as it's been said, the unseen details are the main problem. What's more, the subtleties of Aaliyah's mishap simply don't make any sense. We should begin with how obscure Aaliyah's Uncle Barry Henderson was Barry Henderson was the proprietor of Blackground Records, which Aaliyah had a record managed so Barry ought to have been liable for her well-being right. Well, the thing is Barry Henderson is as vile really as night portrayed. Him as a wickedness man who attempted to make her life damnation during their separation and care fight bars craftsmen have likewise depicted him as an obsessive person who got them under some very content. Rack's vocalist Jojo once uncovered Barry and Blacker records for treating her horrendously. She said they put her on a severe 500-calorie diet to keep her thin, didn't permit her to have the freedoms to her music, and even pushed to liquor and substance. Then, at that point, there's Tony Braxton, who sued Barry for $10 million guaranteeing he generally put his monetary interest of Ed Overs, so Barry is simply overall around terrible news for craftsmen to be around him, Yet this is where it gets more obscure. Re-four days before Aaliyah was planned to go to the Bahamas to record her music video, 
Barry purportedly went to take out a refund of some kind assurance that would permit him to get away from responsibility if Alaya or any individual from her group got into a mishap during the outing. However, if you begin taking actions like that and the individual, subscribe Apple World for more videos.